What's going on, you sexy beast? Welcome once again to another edition of Drathomus Gaming. I am your host, Drathomus. Today, I want to talk a little bit about some shotguns, in particular, the S12. It's a semi automatic shotgun that looks like a SIG 556, which is freaking awesome. This thing is pretty freaking amazing. You unlock it before the M1216, but I kind of prefer the S12 over the M1216 solely because how the magazines work with the M1216 having to rotate it or whatever the heck it has to do. And the S12 generally being an overall baller badass. So let's go ahead and step into some stats. This thing's got 12 round magazine with 14 rounds in the magazine if you have extended mags. It fires at 400 rounds per minute, which may be low, but it's a shotgun. So that is awesome. The range is 50 meters. That is the maximum effective range of this weapon, which it will be extended by 8 meters with long barrel. So bringing that up to 58 meters before full damage drop off occurs. One shot is up to 5 meters, so that's assuming all the pellets will hit. That will get you a kill. So the reload speed is 3.04 seconds with the round left in the chamber, and 3.7 seconds with an empty magazine. Fast mags reduces the reload time with the chambered round down to 2.02 seconds and 2.5 seconds with an empty magazine. Now this thing is pretty much the close quarters king. You just spam the trigger of somebody you're aiming in the general direction, and you get the kill. But the sad thing is, it's pretty much lackluster outside of short range combat. If there's anybody that is just on the edge of your crosshair, like, you know that they're just at the range, you kind of lose. <laughs> if they're shooting first, you're pretty much boned. Now... If you do get the jump on somebody, just usually two or three clicks of the gun, bam, they're down. It's a shotgun, it's pretty simple, gotta love it. So my preferred attachments for this gun are to make it a more maneuverable close quarters weapon, which will include laser sight, fast magazines, and long barrel. Long barrel is going to help counteract that quick drop off of damage from the shells and give you that more effective fighting range but it's not going to be much but it's still all you can get as well as a laser sight and fast mags pretty sure i already said that but this is to counteract the long reload time of three seconds for the s12 bringing it down to two seconds which is pretty fast and getting that uh, every other reload being faster which is pretty sweet it's a since it is a magazine shotgun you don't have to sit there and wait until you get all the shells in it now the long barrel helps reduce that drop off which is awesome and the laser sight is to obviously complement the hip fire capabilities of the shotgun now any shotgun is going to be awesome at close quarters combat but if you have to take that extra like 0.25 to half a second 0.25 seconds to half a second time to aim down the sights you may or may not be at a disadvantage so just getting that shooting right off the bat helps a ton. The total loadout that I run with this gun focuses mainly on the gun itself. Like I've said before, I don't really use any tactical or lethal grenades since I kind of like my gun to do the talking for me. Now that said, shock charges, concussion grenades, and flashbangs piss me off. So I went ahead and picked up tactical masks for the third perk and I am in love with it they pretty much do absolutely nothing now if you get hit by a shock charge instead of taking damage and just standing there like an idiot your screen just flashes and that's it and you just keep running and keep doing your thing so for the first perk I got hardline that's obviously to get out those score streaks faster UAV and AGR and lightning strike are my preferred they're low kills because I usually run a gun and will be in the thick of fray. So if I can get a whole bunch of kills really quick and then more than likely die, I'm fine with that. Since I got low score streaks, but they are really effective. UAV, pretty much everybody should run because that is such a team helper. And Scavenger, which makes sense. This thing only has 40 rounds total if you do not have extended mags. So you got 10 in your first magazine and 3 spare magazines. 
for me, it usually takes about half a magazine of me to spam click and usually hitting about half of my pellets into the wall at rather, at rather than the person to get a kill. So I'll be running out of ammunition way, way, way too fast. So scavenger helps a lot. If you're not up to rank 44 yet, I would prefer whatever you prefer. There's not really many good perk twos, which kind of sucks unless you want cold blooded or toughness. But this gun doesn't really require either unless you want to hide from the UAV with cold blooded. Now for the third perk, obviously tactical mask. I kind of thought it was underrated thinking that it wasn't going to be too great. But now that I've actually picked it up, I'm in love with it. People that do use their couple of points or whatever you want to call it for the pick 10 will be pretty much useless because they've wasted tactical points or tactical grenades on shock charges or conk nades and they're not doing anything to you. Now, since I love my gun, I have primary gunfighter for my wild card, as well as perk 3 greed, which should be obvious because I have two perk 3s. Now, that is my setup. You can run it whichever way you want. It's all personal preference. Now, the best way I've found out how to fight with this gun is the same way you do with SMGs. Don't aim down the sights. There's no reason to aim down the sights with a shotgun unless you're using the KSG which fires sniper rifle slugs or whatever the heck that crazy d gun does. But this gun is a hip fire king. You just spam click all you can, get the kill, aim for center mass, and you'll be golden. Now this gun does have a lot of shortcomings which will obviously be outshined by SMG at a medium range or assault rifle or sniper rifle at a longer range but if you do happen to close that gap between you and your enemy you are just going to murderize them but that's all I got for this gun the S12 semi-automatic kick ass shotgun I hope you guys enjoyed it please give it a thumbs up if you did drop a comment if you can give some feedback say what I can do better next time or just say that you like cookies so that's all I got guys I hope you have a fantabulous night